Yeah, there's, there's no one else has like just been doing the things that he's done. Yeah, like we do have other snakes for sure, but like in terms of like the best snake, definitely Key takes the cake. Sure. Yeah, you got what fifth at Chronicles? Yeah, that's yeah. Almost beating out Elegant, beating out some, uh, beating out Snorter. He definitely a threat. Oh, oh that's yeah, a C the sneaky C4. The sticky setup, the sticky icky. Hey, careful, man. Certain parts of SoCal interpret that as a Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> I was going to say, man. Yeah, we, we're in Hollywood, right? Yeah, Snoop Dogg might be looking at you like, hold on, what do you got in your hands? <laughs> Come here, kid. He's too busy running his game show. That's yeah, good for him, dude. All right, anyways, let's get back to it. Some Whoa, that killed? I, I don't know, man. I'm, that's amazing to me, but I'm not surprised, too, because it's just that Nikita is actually pretty well. Nikita's a top tier. I'm glad they buffed it, dude. It was honestly a, a night. A it was a troll move. Yeah, in, in Brawl, it was just a troll move. Like. Getting into it, it's not. Band uh, not really getting a chance to hit Snake again right now. Like, he's gotten him up to 115, and I'd like to say 30% of that is thanks to Key's grenades, but hey, percent, percent. Yeah. A lot of it is like at that situation, Band kind of took to the platform, and he should have been at the stage. Looking for a possible edge guard, get a reaction. But unfortunately, like for him, he was just trying to find the plot, trying to use the platform for something else, and he was not. Alright, well, Key able to come back to the stage here, looking pretty safe. Oh, but big bad. Tell him, bro, you can go back out there. I do not want you on the stage. Go down there. Surprised Key didn't try to air dodge I'm pretty sure he was just confident that uh, Ban probably wasn't going to go edge guard him, but, you know, he caught him by surprise. He's going to be looking out for that now. Oh, oh, big combo coming in. Yeah, neutral gets up into the grenade, so. Okay. One thing to know about Kira right, is he's. It sounds like he's doing a lot, but I'm not gonna lie, he's actually pretty playing pretty optimal. He's not overcommitting. Yeah, he's not overcommitting. He kind of is using the grenades to have the stage, right? Uh, yeah. And just kind of reading band. And the problem that band's having is, like, I really want to get percent here. He finally able to get a back air, and that's gonna get him stage two. I'd like to see Ban maybe uh, when these grenades are getting thrown at him, maybe just try to suck it up and shoot it back because yeah. he can do that. And then once that happens, grenade will send at like a pretty horizontal angle, so it'll go come really fast. And if he times it just right, it might just explode in his face. The problem for Ban here too is that he always happens to be where Key has the setups. Like at that situation, he went for the up smash and he went for the Nikita. So the minute he grabbed Key, like those projectiles came back, and they eventually. Uh, come. Grab break, so that allowed him to come back off the stage. Yeah, so and come like, back. Yeah, and, and right there you saw, uh, yeah, the roll. It's hard. And right there you even saw when he was uh, off stage, he threw a grenade, and Band gave up stage control just because he was afraid of the grenade. Instead yeah. of grabbing it, throwing it back, or doing anything, and he just like he would get back for free. He didn't get a single chance to set up like the thing that DDD is known for: these ledge traps. You put the Gordo down. You're out here shaking people. Yeah. Not only that though. He did a lot to frustrate Band in a sense where, like, he would go for if I'm going to be at the ledge, I'm going to set up up smash, I'm going to set up the Nikita, I'm going to set up the grenades. So if you roll in, right, you get hit by the grenades. If you try to go from the air, you get hit by the up smash on the Nikita. If you grab me, you chances are you will be hit by those items. So he did a lot to cover his bases for sure. Letting him know, like, hey, if I'm going to edge guard you, I'm going to edge guard you effectively, where if you do come back or if you slip through the cracks here, uh, you will get hit by something. Yeah, that's all. That was the the difference between the two characters and the way they uh they they would ledge guard is Snake. There's so much more to worry about. Whereas uh, versus DDD, it's just one thing and one big punish. But you yeah. know what? The DDD's gone. He's going back to the Fox, which I think is a, a good option. Fox it does a lot. Yeah, Fox does a lot to really keep Snake in disadvantage. Once he gets a moving Snake, yeah, he can grenade himself, but he ends up. Wait, did he just die? He did. Oh, he did. Neutral got up, dude. That, that, that actually ended up causing him the whole stock. That's the thing about Bad Dude. He had. It's kind of weird, like, to choose, and choose your option. You don't want to be careful when you come back on the stage. I feel like you should just let go of ledge, come back with side B, or they'll come back with a neutral B instead. Sorry, up B. Or even, yeah, because saw himself probably with a neutral B as well. All right. Use up. a couple lasers, use the shine, and Ban gets the flash key. He's still living. All right, you really got to make sure you edge guard him right here. Uh, he didn't get his uh, positioning right. He wanted. To, it looked like he wanted to run off. But he just didn't get the spacing right, so he decided not to do anything about it. Yeah. He makes the recovery here. And goes for dash attack. Not going to find much. There's a Stairmaster Master out of shield. that didn't kill. Oh, yeah. He's dead now. Oh, he's done, bro. He, he really went back down there. He was like, okay, you know what? I'm going to find you. I don't trust it, man. <laughs> 
Ricky taking a sweet time. Pretty big lead, 104% bad, having much uh, much more trouble against Snake, especially his locks. He's getting way too impatient. He got yeah. hit by every one of those ciphers that were coming up. He didn't even try to shield it. Maybe even reflect it if you're cheeky. Just do anything about it. He's letting... He's doing a really good job of covering himself when he's off stage. He'll throw a grenade. He'll make sure a C4 is right there. And yeah. Banjo's getting too impatient. He's thinking, I need to hit Snake. And you got to think, what's everything Snake's throwing out right now? Exactly. The, the item management from Snake also would to understand. The, the approach of Snake, the timing. Scare Master, that won't kill. But he doing an excellent out of shield option. And uh, it's B reverse. I like that. He's using these B reverse grenades to get to moving down. Wow, that was a little bit of a Michael Bay movie with those explosions in the background. And that's an old kind of thing. Yeah, Firefox actually uh, will go through Nikita uh, once the uh, Firefox is actually started. But once you're in the startup of it, it'll usually beat it out. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. He didn't run into it. I thought it was going to... Right now, Key just kind of setting up his stage right now. Saying, you got to come towards here and you got you have a lot to get through. You're at 150. I can hit you with the, whatever I want and it'll kill. Great recovery right in the wall right there. Yeah, I like how patient Band is being right now. He's realizing what he needs to do and how he needs to get around it, but it might be too little too late. He's already at 157. Next grab is going to kill. And, you know, next hit really from him. Oh! Oh, not dead yet. There's a setup, and... Not the box setup. Oh, no! Key, you're a you're, fiend. You're, you're, you're oh, but right in the wall, say, like, no if, box. If he actually died from the box, like, I was going to say, Key, you're a fiend. You're a fiend, man. Hey, but, I, but I like that box setup, though. Yeah, I do, too. Damn, I was gonna say, man, Kira Fiend. <laughs> like, if you really actually got that.